the power of tonality in your voice in a cafe. Hi guys, my name is Deepak Shukla, founder of the Pearl Lemon Cafe. We are a coffee chain dedicated to helping you baristas, customer service people, and everybody else in between out there create the most amazing experiences for anyone who walks into your store, bar, cafe, coffee shop, club, pub, whatever it may be. And if you're enjoying these videos, please feel free to comment, like, and subscribe, as well as click the link in the description below to get access to our advanced training. So we're talking about the power of tonality, okay? So you must have heard that expression, it's not what you say, it's the way that you say it. And I really want to hammer that into you that for, certainly for the, 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 the British palate and the British tongue, uh, I'm British, born and raised, it's a real challenge to really get to grips and to nail tonality. It's not something that's really a part of our language easily as such, but it definitely, definitely is something that you should really consider when it comes to the way that you communicate. You want to instill tonality in the way that you talk, and that relates to really the, 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 the melody, the timber, the uh, vocal gymnastics, um, the, the range of um, pitch and frequency when you communicate because it just makes such a difference. Otherwise, you get into that world of saying, um, you know, I love you the same way as can you pass me the milk? And isn't that a tragic thing if the way that you say, I love you, babe, is the same way as can you pass me the milk? Do you see the difference there? So when it comes to the, what can I get for you? Ah, hey, morning, how you doing? Instead of, morning, how you doing? Yeah, good, what can I get for you? Yeah, all right, amazing, it's a cappuccino, yeah? Do you see how different that is versus, so let's do that again. Morning, how you doing? Yeah, what can I get for you, a cappuccino? Morning, how you doing? Good, good. So, cappuccino, again this morning, Frank? Okay, brilliant, leave that with me, coming right up. Do you see the difference between that versus, morning, Frank, how you doing? Yeah, cappuccino, all right, cool, coming right up. Do you see the big, big difference between those t those those styles and how that can make a significant difference to the way that you communicate when it comes to your tonality? So really do think about the way in which you communicate. Now you could look up Jordan Belfort. Um, he's you know he's a great person who talks about this. So, but 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 really, I mean Jordan, just just listen to me, <laughs> Jordan Belfort. Tonality. You can re, you can look it up on YouTube. There's probably there's probably more books on this and stuff in general. But fundamentally, it, again, it relates to the way that you communicate. It's it adds so much ultimately uh, feeling to the things that you say. I I've learned this a lot from the um, you know my partner. She's Italian, uh, born and raised, and you know it comes to the the Italian voice a lot more naturally. But it's about having the control and knowing when you want to sound um, apathetic, when you want to sound highly engaged, when you want to sound intrigued. Ah, okay, okay. Really? Is that what happened? Mate, are you kidding me? Are you being serious? Wow. Do you hear how I said that? Are you being serious? Uh, and I did that quite per Are you being serious? Are you being serious? Seriously? Serious. Do you, do you see how different they become? Hold on, you want a latte today, Frank? Are you feeling okay? Are you sure? Did you get hit on the head this morning? So you can let me, do you see how playing with speed, playing with pace really opens up the emotion and feeling with the way that you say things? So tonality is, 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 is massively important. I'd absolutely consider the way that you, morning, Frank, how you doing, sir? Morning, morning, morning. How are we? Morning, mate. Good. And do you see, by the way, there abbreviations, depending upon who you're talking to, can work. And we'll go in in some of the advanced training to talk about when to use abbreviations and when not to. But fundamentally, tonality is going to be absolutely critical to the way that you communicate your language effectively in a coffee shop environment. And that comes also and relates to speed, the speed at which you say things. And sometimes you can slow down and then sometimes you can speed up. So get into the habit of when you're by yourself, playing with tone, so it just becomes a natural part of the way that you communicate. And it's gonna make the world of difference when you are building up 
that instant rapport that we talk about <clears throat> inside a cafe. So, yeah, morning. How's your day? Happy Monday, if there is such a thing. Oh, here we go again. The week has commenced. So you can experiment and play with it. But the most important takeaway from this video is that you do need to use tonality and you do need to make the power or just just you need to make use of the full power of your voice. And this really comes through practice. That's the most critical thing that you need to work with here. And this is something that will carry over into every aspect of your life, okay? Every aspect of your life, the tonality is, is absolutely critical to just the way that you make someone feel, the way probably that you feel, and the experiences that you can whip up, generate, create just through the power of your voice. So there you have it, guys. Um, get into the habit of using your tone powerfully inside the coffee shop to just get amazing responses from people and a much, much higher level of engagement. And that includes speed, pace, frequency, and all of the things in between.